Hi Libras. This is LT Tarot about to do your August love readings. So here's the thing. No, I'm just kidding. So anyway, guys, make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe. Um, if this reading resonates and you want to um, getting, you know, get a deeper understanding of this reading or a personal reading, you can always click on the link below and um, book your personal readings. My readings are so low, so cheap, such a good deal. You know, they start off at five dollars and um, and they go up. So um, depending on how deep your of a reading you need. Um, definitely uh you know definitely book it i feel like sometimes like doing it that way um you get a deeper understanding you know of what's going on with your life and it, it resonates more to you instead of actually clicking on a video another video i mean, I mean i'm going to have the videos eventually um as an additional um option if you want to purchase additional videos i am getting someone to work on those webs um that website um i plan on expanding this as much as possible um but anyway you guys you know you didn't come in here for that so i'm not gonna um keep you long um just want to make this a quick reading for you and see uh let you guys know what you got going on in your love life so first thing of thing uh first so you're looking for sorry my phone is telling me i got 20 percent you're looking for appreciation. That's what the overall energy is. Is that you want it, you want it to be appreciated, and you just feel like you haven't really been appreciated lately. Um, it seems like how I feel is that I, it feels to me it, a lot of heaviness. Um, the heaviness is that you're like you're requiring somebody to. Um, to respect you on a deeper level and to understand your mind, understand your needs, your thoughts, your thought process. And it's like the other person is requiring that from you, but they're not giving you that back. It's like you, you're doing the work to do that for them, but they're not giving you that back. Right? So the thing is, it's like you feel underappreciated. You feel like that you're not appreciated in this relationship and that you're not really happy with the fact that they can't understand your needs. And you feel like it's a little one-sided. What's happening here is that there will be some new beginnings, though. So this is a new beginning in abundance, a new beginning in money, and so it's going to kind of it's going to be a big shift where um, basically the old way of things is not going to be allowed in, in, uh, this time around because you are you are looking for that stability because pinnacles are more or less like the earth cars the st and earth is stability and that's what you're looking for and it's like you're not playing any games you want what you want and you're not you're not allowing anything else at this point and you are and it's like you're fed up you're so fed up that you're like if i gotta find somebody else i will because of the fact that i deserve and want love i want this appreciation i want abundance i want happiness and I see that this has been a long journey here. So it's kind of like this person, they've um, almost like it's been so long. It's like this person here, they packed up their their um, their suitcases and they're ready to go. And they're ready to just, you know, walk away from this. I see that you are going to overcome this. Like it's a lot of burden on you. And it's kind of like you if you got to... Uh, Get on your ship and go away you will like you're not you're not um sorry you're not um you're not putting up with a lot and you want somebody to you know it's kind of like you doing all the work see how this person here is doing all this work this person they ain't doing nothing they just enjoying the ride they don't understand how hard it is for this person to make this boat go right and you know they this right here they want to go uh i mean they 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 doing all the work and they, they you know and it's like i'm doing what i gotta do because i know you're not gonna do the work and so that's why you kind of like ready to pack your stuff up because you're tired of it you're tired of doing all this work you're tired of uh, putting up with this 
putting up with this laziness. Like, look at this person. Like, what is you doing? Why are you holding this box here? Like, you see, so that, so that, that type of crap will piss me off. Because you see I'm over here peddling this, uh, this boat. And here you over here with a box in your hand, praising to Allah. Ain't that wrong praising to God. But it's like, what you doing? This ain't, the, this ain't the time and the place for it. The time and the place for this right now is for you to get your ass up and get a pedal and let's do this together. I mean, because you're not, that's why you're not feeling appreciated here. Because you're doing all the work. You are, I, I get you. You are tired of doing this work. You're tired of putting up with it. And I feel like when you stand up for yourself, you got, it's hostility. Like this person is being very hostile for you. And you just kind of upset about that. And it's like, it's going to be a lot. It's going to be a death of a situation because of the fact that you're not, you're not willing to do the work, all the work. You'll do some of the work. You'll do 50, 50. You will almost do 60, 40, but you're not going to do all the work. You kind of like, you want, you want this person to show you that they care in some way, shape and form. There's a lot of attachment to this person though. So it's like, it could be mental. Um, I don't know if you guys have ever heard of something called like cutting the cords. Like people say that and like I never knew what that meant, like cutting the cords, but there are spiritual cords with people. I mean, that you're tied to people. And that's what, that's what the attachment is coming from. And it's like, if you want to move forward, you're gonna have to cut these spiritual cords with this person because you have the hangman and this is a uh this card is very spiritual this card is actually like leaving the situation um there's a temporary pause in action it's kind of like death of a situation release of a situation but you're leaving the situation behind and um and you're moving on and so that's pretty much what this this reading is is that you feel like you want to move on You may be dealing with a Leo, you guys, the sun card here. It's like every time you get hopeful about a situation, every time you feel good about it, it's like they're giving you the cold shoulder because you see all this ice and it's like you kind of just want to get your shit and, uh, and go away. Like that's pretty much what the energy of these cards are. Like all of them is like you want to leave. And it's like you leaving them behind and you like it's like you're sneaking out away in the middle of the night just to get rid of i mean just to get away from this person you could be a woman holding your heart like you could be the woman or the woman figure in this relationship and it's like you kind of hot trying to hide your heart from them and it's like or you feel like the, if you're a man you feel like that person has your heart but you, even though that person have your heart, you, you, you have to make the right decision for you. Because I see that once you walk away, you're going to find love. So it's like you hold, you taking your heart back to move on to another person. Because I see once you actually finally move to this new person, you're going to finally find true love and divine love. But you have to get out of this hostile situation and move forward. So it's like you taking your heart back to find true love. And I mean, and it's definitely okay for you to do that because I see that you're not happy and you feel like you put doing all the work. Now, if this resonates for you and you want an extended reading or want a reading, you can definitely um, click on the link below and, um, you know, sign up for a personal reading. Also, if you haven't already, please go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys next time.